Hi, social media marketers. My name is Carrie from Social Bakers, and I want to share our top five productivity hacks from the experts. Today's marketers are having to deal with two big challenges. Number one, staying at the forefront of an ever changing social media landscape. Hmm. Number two, understanding that success is achieved by maintaining this velocity, but without the stress. The need to feel productive is at an all-time high with the constant Sweet feeding of the content monster Sweet. across multiple different platforms. With this overwhelming stress comes a greater need to detox from screens and distractions. Ryan A. Bell says his productivity hack is turning off his phone and leaving it in the car when he gets home because he hates feeling like he is not a fully attentive and productive dad. For the first hack, let's talk about time. Award-winning blogger Rebecca Redis suggests using tools to help you manage time, such as Focus Booster, which is a really cool app that helps you stay focused. So you set your timer for about mm, 25 minutes and you focus really hard on one particular thing that's the most important to you, and then you give yourself a five minute break. Speaking of breaks, tip number two comes from Ben M. Roberts, and he has quite an interesting tip that he calls Amish hour. Basically, this means no technology. You use this time to focus on something that is completely offline, such as reading, cleaning, horseback riding, singing on an Austrian hilltop wearing a dirtle, something like that. Just completely offline for this one hour of tech-free time. Tip number three also comes from Ben, suggesting to only check your emails three times per day, unless expecting something urgent. He found that checking it first thing in the morning, right after lunch, and right after 5 p.m. would allow him to keep up with conversations, but without getting swamped. So our next tip, tip number four, comes from Mordecai Holtz, suggesting to use collaborative tools for marketing growth, such as Slack, Trello, Google Docs, and Asana, for example. These tools will help you to create a more effective workflow. Looking for inspiration to help your team create content? Check out our free content inspiration tool within the description. This is gonna show you all of the content posted around all the different multiple platforms in just one click. So, what collaborative tools are you using? Let us know in the comments. Our last and final tip, tip number five, comes from Kian Corbett, and he is all about making lists. To make them more effective, he prioritizes them by urgency and limits the time that he spends on each of them. He finds that putting deadlines with tasks will sort things into two categories. So number one, things that I need to do. Number two, things I prefer to do. I hope these tips help you to become more productive and to de-stress a little bit. Drop us a comment with your favorite productivity hacks that you use. And for even more tips, check out our blog, which is in the description below. And don't forget, to subscribe for even some more social media tips. All right, now it's time for me to go be productive. Bye.